So let's get started with NPC problems, vertex coloring. I'm looking forward to this one. Unity, very popular. See, NPC, there we go, NPC problems, vertex coloring by Samuel Ribeiro. Press any key. It's very quiet. Let's see what the settings are. There we go. That's a little better. Oops. There we go. Okay. Um, eight levels. So there are, what, four stages? So what, maybe 32 levels? Okay. Well, here we go. I mean, it's only a dollar. Can't expect a million puzzles, right? All right, so minimum number of colors, number of colors used. Try to paint the circles using the minimum number of colors. Use a mouse to select a color and paint. Oh. Level failed. What did I do wrong? I guess what the linked circle cannot have the same colors. Oh, okay. I missed that first message. There we go. And then you started getting smarter than a robot. <laughs> sure. Acceptable solution. One star. That's it? How do I get how do I get more stars? Like not exceed the number of minimum colors? There we go. Best solution. Okay. I I think I understand now. I need three colors. So like this one and this one. There we go. It's simple. Again, three colors. Interesting. How do you get three out of this one? Because this touches three. That touches three. Right? Oh, and these two don't touch either. There we go, that's better. Yeah, three stars, there we go. Four colors now, huh? Be this one or this one? Let's go with that one. No, yeah, let's go with that one. No, maybe I have the wrong one here then. Because this is an acceptable solution, but it's not the, the best solution, right? So let's start with here again. Now we can go top or bottom, and that's it. So it has to be one of these, and it doesn't matter. Since it's a symmetrical puzzle, I can pick either one to complete it properly. So it's either this one, this one, or this one. Actually, do uh, 
I like this game. It's very fascinating how it's like, it looks like an easy solution. So actually, let's do the middle ones first. Let's see if we can get away with... Alright, so green. Everything is touching this center one. And everything is touching this middle one. Which means your opposite ones have to be here. No, not everything's touching this one. That's it. There we go. I understand it now. It's knowing, so let's start with the one that touches the most. It touches five. It touches four. So one, the, the one that touches five first. Um, there and there, I think. Yeah, that's the only thing that made sense. So do the one that starts with the most. And that's kind of an easy approach to some degree by doing it that way. Sure, you are one, are more smarter than a donkey. <laughs> Why, thank you. <laughs> Did you know that I'm more smarter than a donkey? 27 stars, but it doesn't show me which levels have what stars, do they? Well, that's too bad. You have to guess. Oops, I didn't want to close. Whoops. Wrong button. I can try that again. Yeah, it would have been nice to see which level, like, just putting three stars here, or two stars, or one star, would have been pretty simple, I imagine. But we, uh, we're gonna spend 18 stars here, right? Boom. Oh, wait, can you farm stars? Like, replay the same level over and over again to get stars? So this one touches all of them. I have to get away with six colors here. Here we go. So this one is not symmetrical, right? That's a seven, that's a six. So we'll start with the seven. And we'll do the six. Yeah, I think that's the trick of the game is to do the largest quantity. So there's a six right here. too fast there. Okay, let's try again. Got a little fast. Yeah, it has to be this one and this one and this one. That has to be. There's no other choice for that one. So let's say blue goes here and here. Because blue, all three have, neither of these can, so yeah, red has to go in one of those. 
So red has to actually go in this one. Like that. Like that. There we go. So there's six here and eight here. Ooh, this one's tricky. It's got eight. So we have to put one, I think, here. And it's either here or here, and I don't know which yet. Let's try that one first. We could also wait and slap one on the, f on the next largest, which is this guy, right? Six. Well, both of these are six. I feel like they're both... I shouldn't do both though, I should split it up like that, I think. I don't think this is correct. Which means I think that this one goes here. And then we split up these. And these. There we go. Five colors. So we just go around in a circle starting with the largest, which is eight here, right? That's the largest. Everything else is seven or less. So this one means it's this one and that one. There we go. So this one. Just those two. I think. It could also be that one, right? Let's try that one though. Level 12. Seven for this guy. That's seven for this guy. It's eight for this one and this one. I actually think I want to start with the, one of the sevens here. nine in all of these. And they all have to be like that. So we'll get to that though. Do this guy first. singulars. Ooh, a six, six one. I don't know what that does. I might go with the, well, that's the menu. I wonder what that does. I hope it's not a hint. I'm not going to test it. Two, four, six, eight. This is an eight. This is a seven. Uh, 
Um, where does this one let me go? We'll hold off on that guy. We'll do the next biggest one. are getting worried. <laughs> Alright, we'll unlock luck. Stay I wonder if the green means I got max stars. And maybe like yellow might be I only got one star. That kind of thing. Ooh, this one's interesting. This is a nine. This is a nine. Let's start with this guy. Go here. Each one of these has to be a single color. Ooh, seven. They gave me, ooh, they gave me a nice, like, lime green color. Nice. This is a 10. This is also a 10. Which one is it not touching? Down here. So I don't know if it's this guy or if it's this guy. Which one's more? This guy's more. So we'll just start with that one. Um, and we'll do the next biggest one. This guy. Alright, so there's only two options, A or B. They're both, oh, this one's, they're both nine. Let's try that one. Uh, let's do this one next. Go here. I don't know if it matters which one of these I take. Yeah, we got it. Who? Well, let's start in the middle here. They're all getting quite wildly fractal, frac fractured. This one hits all of them. This is a singular. Okay. So let's go here next. This one also hits all of them, yeah? As does that one. So it could be either A or B. Let's go A. Let's see what this one hits. No, we did not complete this one proper. Okay, so now let's go back to the let's go back to the menu and see if we we different different color on it. We do. I thought it would be like a yellow. So yellow means we did not perfect it. So we have 19 stars. So if we did this level again, would we gain two stars or three stars when we perfect it? So this one's a loner, right? Yeah, it has to be a loner. And then, what wasn't there another that was a loner or close to it? This one I think is symmetrical. It's looking symmetrical to me. 
just from the without like inspecting it too much it just gives off the vibe of being symmetrical so i don't know if it's this one or this one matters i just feel like whichever one i take dictates where this one goes which i think we did that one last time so let's do this one next time now let's do uh This guy also hits all of them. That's right. As does this guy. Yeah, those two hit. So all three of these hit all of them. There we go. I just chose the wrong one whenever I did that one. I think it was. So let's see if we gain... What do we have? I think we do gain stars. Let's, pr let's prove that theory. So we have 22, right? Dun, dun, dun. Okay, maybe not. Maybe you can only gain stars. Um, maybe maybe it did do the math proper. I had 20. I don't know. I wasn't paying attention. I thought I only had 19 though. Alright, so this and this can be the same. Perhaps let's do this one a little differently. Let's go from left to right. This one's only got three colors available. I think this one going from left to right might be a better option. It's going to be one of these three. Um, it has to be one of these three because this one can't share. Oh man, this is actually tricky. So let's actually not do the start from here. Let's start over here, where we have the triad that has to be split. And this one has to be the same. Those two have to be the different, or the same, I mean. Now we go here and here. Because this one's symmetrical too, so I don't think it matters if it's this one or if it's this one. Then we go here. We could also go here, but I think here is better. Now we can go there, 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 and there, and then the pink should fill in the rest. There we go. That was better. Starting at the triad was definitely better. Instead of starting away from it and hope that I make it correct along the way back. Only four. So this is the central. Let's start here. This one hits all of them. Put the corners. And then this guy, or this guy. Uh, I'm gonna pick this guy for sure. It allows me to do this and this. With. Wait, did I mess up? No, no, I think I'm good. Nope, 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 nope. No, I think I did mess up. Let's try again. This. This, this, and this. I think that is like the correct answer there. And now we only have two color. Oh, it's four. I thought it was three. My bad. Because when I was doing this one, I'm like, oh no, I only got two colors left, but I wasn't counting. Yeah, I messed. I messed up in my own mind. What my uh, availability was. What's wrong with? Because we have a triad here, we have to fulfill. There we go. This one's not symmetrical. Now we can... Now we can actually... Hmm. Being that's such a short game I, I and simple game, I kind of want to do... I kind of want to three-star every level. So let's work on this triad now.
And maybe we hold off on this one, but I swear that's the best choice for this guy. Linking four as opposed to linking three. I think it's just strictly better. So now we have four colors to link here. We got a triad here, here, and here. So blue has to go here. Then yellow, I think has to go here. Pink can fulfill that and blue does the rest, right? No, I keep getting this one. This keeps happening right here. And then do I move pink down? And I get a, I've got a triad right here. And then blue goes here. No, because then yellow's over here. So pink, I think, I think these two have to be the same. Pretty sure of it. Yeah, there we go. That's what it was. This guy was the wrong color. Ooh, only three. So let's start. Is there any triad anywhere? Yes, here. Right here. That has to be like that. Do I just do it across like this? No, I want to split it up like that. Because on this one. Oh, but I have a triad here. I can't do that. So I have, a, I have a triad here and here and here. So if that's the case, red, red, blue, pink, pink. That could very well be wrong and I'm expecting it to kind of be wrong. So then we switch red and pink here. So then we switch blue. Oh man. Only three colors, huh? Nope, red has to be on the tops. Let's go in now from this. No, because red ha red can't be there then. I think red has to be there and there. And then purple fills in gaps here. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Second, I got a message. Okay. Let's see here. So we can start on this end and work our way left. To here, to here, or to here and here. That's better. I like that better. Because then we have a triad here that has to be... Which means red might actually go here. We'll find out. I do have three colors to play with right now. I don't think this is correct. Maybe we should have gone to this guy next. And yeah, we are doing this very wrong. So let's start with this guy here. Work our way down. Let's actually do that. And then we do the central. This is very wrong. <laughs> I 
Alright. Let's try that. Because we have a triad here to, to maintain. So that means these can be opposites. But we have a triad here to maintain. This is very wrong. Bad solution. Won't even let me progress if I'm too over. This one's tricky. So let's um this and this. No, no, sorry. This is a quad, right? It means all four colors have to go one, two, three, four. So maybe we work our way over from this. We can't be. So this one has to be yellow. This one has to be blue, or this one has to be red, and this one has to be blue. This one has to be purple. This one has to be blue. This one has to be yellow. And this one has to be red. This one has to be yellow. This one has to be blue. This one has to be purple and yellow. Yeah, going from following it along the line, since I had a forced four color, following it down the road was the way to solve that one. Ooh, three colors. So let's look for a triad easily right here. One, two, three. Is this one can't, can must be blue. This must be red. Blue. Green. Blue. I like this jumping back and forth thing. Working quite well. Oops. <laughs> As I mess one up. Nice. You are the new Turing. Alright. Three colors. So any triads here? Yes. This one's a beginner one. At least I felt like it was. Ooh, that's cool drawing like shapes. Like three-dimensional shapes somewhat. Sort of. So we'll start with the triad again and just let it solve itself, I guess, right? Until we get to multiple choice here. In which case we can just deduce it. All right, we got four colors now. like that. I think that's the better option. Oops, that's not what I wanted. That's what I wanted. Okay, so we've got triads we left over and we can't do that. So let's actually, um, let's start with a triad. Like that. I could put 
Oh, wait, no, I figured it out. Ooh, yeah, it's just drawing cool, fun shapes at this moment. Seems like. All right, we got a, we got a four. So there's a triad here. Means we could throw a blue here. No, we can't. This is a quad. That has to be yellow. Let's try putting pink here. But I don't know if that's correct. That has to be yellow then if I do that. Is that okay? I can feel like these some of these puzzles have more than one solution. Oops. I mean, it feels like some of these have... Ooh, that's broad. This one is symmetrical. Then we just zigzag our quads down. Oh no, what am I thinking? Oops. Everything's a quad, basically, right? Ooh, this one's fun. This one's fun. So we just start with a triad and go from there, huh? We also just, like, alternate. Let's assume that those are opposing there. I think there's, there were multiple solutions to that one. Ooh, only three again. Triads everywhere though. This one kind of builds itself. Which in a way is not, oops, I thought I clicked purple. It's not as challenging as I had hoped. This could be either pink or blue. Ooh, that one's fun. be challenging or actually be more annoying than necessarily challenging is forcing you to start over every time you failed by repeating a color like that I would have had me start over but that would actually just be annoying more than it would be difficult oh 
No, wait, no, we're good. Completed the spiderweb level. Is that it? Did we win? GG. Well, that was quick. Three stars on every level.